Okay, new day. Back to Siren, and I should probably adjust this desk so everything's kind of facing me right. Whoa, 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 yourself. Uh, we're going to try and get through a couple more uh, levels of Siren. Don't need to watch all this bullshit. And we're going to have a quick glitch out from the start, which sometimes happens when I restart everything in the morning. Hello, Alan. Glad you showed up, though. We might need you. We're trying to, uh... Make sure that we're not buffering too much for other people because we're doing a higher, uh, uh, frame rate, whatever. I'm too tired to think right now, just leave me alone. No, not new game again. So, if you see buffering, assuming you're watching this live and not afterwards, let me know because I can kind of judge, thank you, uh, whether or not it's a big issue or not for multiple people or if it's just going to affect a couple. We're hoping not that many. Excuse I like to, I usually keep my stream up so I can kind of judge as well on my laptop next to me. And it's... Alright. So I'm just going to jump in. We're going to see what happens. And I am now on full brace. So I have nowhere to go and I can't really move much or I wobble. So Iris, I'm not opening anything for you. I got brace. I can't really lift my leg. I can't. I'm going to try it. I'm going to lean back. I might fall. This isn't working very well. <laughs> And there's sort of a toe or something. Um, there's my brace. I can't bend my leg. It's one of those braces that have the uh, the uh, little adjustment thing on it. So I am literally stuck at a certain uh, kind of like angle so I don't hurt myself. And people look at me very strange today because I'm not wearing my pants because pants and braces don't get along. It's too warm in the summer to wear my leggings because they're mostly fleece. And people all think I'm weird because I'm wearing a nice dress and wearing a brace. So, well, fuck it. Then again, everybody thinks when I dress up that I'm going somewhere, and it's like, no, I just like to look nice sometimes. Hi, doctor. Help! Oh, Nina. She doesn't mind. She, uh... Wait. When I got home, Are she you... like, ran out and started licking my leg. You must be Dr. Miata. I'm Mina's twin. I'm Riza. Mina's hey, Riza. sister. I was just on my way to see her. Is she okay? Where is she? Where is Staying she? Staying comfy is the hard part. I might be trying to adjust my chair a bit, trying to do Twins. things. Oof. Okay. So this level is this mission two. So acquire ID holder. So I'm gonna leave Risa behind and hope she doesn't die. I was looking for Mina as well. Mina. Okay. Let's go to the hospital. They do. Dogs are good at sensing injuries and stuff. Hey, bub. So, yeah. So this is the level where it makes sense why we, in a prior level, took the wet cloth and we got it wet and we put it in the freezer. It actually helps this character out. Now, why we did it at the very beginning. Well, hello, Commander Root. I see you are new to my horde. But we, uh... By going and doing that, we make this level so much easier. Because without doing that, we would be struggling at this part coming up. Because we need to get a really asshole of a zombie, to be fair. The uh, police officer who was shooting at us in the beginning. We have to take him, basically, and remove him from this room right there. And if I open the door, he will just shoot me and I'm going to die because... Oops, sorry, I forgot I changed my commands. He's just going to kill me because I can't bring a wrench to a knife fight or a gun fight. Either or, I shouldn't be bringing a wrench to it. And see, this piggy bank is here now instead of that newspaper that we looked at last time. So what I'm going to do is this. Uh, no, don't break it. That's bad. You get shot if you do that. I've done that too. So this is like a timed uh, type of thing. So the cloth will melt, obviously, and then piggy bank will fall, which will draw him out so I can go in the room from the front of the building. Ah, that's a really pretty piggy bank. I kind of want it. Um, leave that door open. Oh, hey there, bub! Die! 
They're not, those surrounds are usually not as scary on the second one, if you know what you're doing. And I don't actually, oh, let me, let me, I don't really need it, but I'm going to grab it because i got nothing else to do right now. But then again, I'm not sure if it actually affects my playthrough later. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. no sorry, it's okay, Iris. Shit, I'm going to die. Yep. I was hoping you couldn't see me behind the wall. I am tired, but it's not, it's not like, oh, how do I explain it? It's like my brain's tired, but the body isn't. But then again, I just uh, was learning to, again today to walk around on my crutches. So I was hobbling around. I went around Costco once, and by the time we got to the other store, I was like, I'm going to use the little cart because I didn't, uh, I didn't want to do that again because that's tiring. You, motherfucker, come here. And so I just did the cart instead. But the problem is, because I, one, am in a dress, but two, because I, I look able-bodied, it's like, people look at you funny, like, when you use those. And I, when I had a hole in my foot a number of years ago, I had to use those knees because I couldn't walk on my foot at all. Like, it, my, I could bend the leg plenty, but the foot could not take any pressure, like there was no, like at least right now if like, I slip in my crutch I can kind of catch myself on my foot and I, I don't, I don't want the toy, I'm okay. But I, uh, I can't do that, I can't do that back then, but people looked at me like I was like nuts because I was using the, the little automatic carts. Why am I still crawling? Because I'm talking and I'm getting distracted and Iris brought me toys. Uh, no. And the people like... <laughs> Someone was uh, kind of making remarks like they didn't actually think I needed it. And, and like, I think it was uh, my roommate at the time who was with me. I think he looked at them and was like, "Do you want her to show? Do you want to see the the hole in her foot?" And I was like, "Yeah, I can show you the hole in my foot." I was, you know, stitch closed at that point. I'd like to put up a photo of it, but I can't right now. I can do it on the the uh, YouTube video though when I put this up. Uh, but it's like I had literally put a curtain rod through the bottom of my foot, so. Yeah, I need. I couldn't walk in the foot, and people judge really hard because of that. And it makes me really uncomfortable when I ride the cart because I feel like everybody's just judging me, even though like I'm injured. It's kind of like how uh, people judge. Uh, basically, if you have a disability because and you have like one of those parking cards or a service animal or whatever, it's like they 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 judge you because you look able-bodied sometimes, and that's really bloody annoying. Yeah, I try not to mind. I try, I try not to mind people, but it's it's hard. Okay, I. So if anybody wonders why I have I have issues sometimes when I go into the, uh, the, uh, pause screens or anything, it's because I swapped the controls, uh, to make it easier for me, but they don't change in the, the, uh, pause screen. So I still have to go back and remember that I have to use those ones. Hey there, buddy. <laughs> That was a good shot. Okay, you I need to watch, because you have something I need. And you! Problem is, it's really hard to sit comfortably with this brace on, because... I can't put the other leg up with it right now, so I'm like, okay, one leg, two leg, both legs, five legs. Well, I got four if I use the crutch, but. And right now there's not much I can do besides wait, so you're gonna have to put up with my rambling. The level after this one I haven't done yet uh, in this playthrough, so it's gonna be more like stress inducing. Correct, I'm a half spider. <laughs> okay, I know it's like, okay, this take her. This is probably the only one cutscene that takes this long, just because you're waiting for something to thaw. Months, 
so many bugs. I need that thing by his arm. I really wish I could say it was the gun I was going to take, but oh, there we go. You timed this so bad, you stupid son of a bitch. Alright. Uh, recipe for honey noodles on the table. And then, look at this. Got it. Alright. <laughs> that, that sniper makes it the hardest. Kyoya Suda. Kyoya Suda student ID holder has been added to the archive. Woot woot. So this is better I'd be animated than like too tired and just sitting here bored or boring other people. I'm gonna be jumping around and I need to pull down my dress. <laughs> Alright, unattempted. <gasps> what, what was that? It's them. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Escape from abandoned house in the Yakukajiro. Okay. Come with me, lady. And come with me quietly. This this stage is kind of two parts. You gotta do the inside first. And this is the door that I need that key for one of the first levels that they don't even really hint at you needing. Because all this has to play through. Out. What's going on here? Uh. Put a hole in the floor. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Excuse me. Oh shit! I lost the blind chick. Did I not? T I didn't even tell her to follow me. That's my bad. Blind lady, come on. Will you come here, lady? There we go. Stay, lady, you stay. Hey! Hey! Like this level, so you're gonna find me going a little bit quiet at times because I had to actually try not to die. Though this level is not as bad as when I'm playing an adult, it's when I have to play the kid in here that I'm like gonna hate my life. Hey! Hey! <laughs> he has a gun! Beat him! Here's this part that I don't like so much. 
So I actually have to be careful going in this room here because there's a Shibita walking outside and if he sees me, he will come in and he makes it all the more fun. You can kind of see him right there. I see his flashlight. I should have fit down there. Oh, he's. Oh, she's a creepy looking one. Me and Nora like. You know, like it all. Oh no, there's other zombies coming in now. Let me past you, let me past you, let me past you. I don't got time for this bullshit right now. Hi there, Zombom chillin'. Not much. Just dying of a, you know, heart attack. I just found that you do face him. Come here, lady. I know. No, I know. Thank you. But I gotta read this thing here. About time. Shut the fuck up. There is some yellow newspaper that is being used in underlay for the tatami mat. Musumi Daily Gazette has been added to the archive. Bye! I see you in the window! How much is that zombie in the window? <laughs> oh, thanks, Alan. Okay. You just stay here. One zombie came inside, he won't be outside anymore. So I have one less zombie to worry about outside now. Oh, you're getting up, you're not happy. But I think the rifle one comes outside now. I, 
would like a drink. Thank you. In fact... corner, please. There's a man with a gun over there, and you should know better blind or not. Okay. <laughs> and what was your distraction? Oh, that one came back out, huh? That's supposed to be one with a rifle somewhere. Not a rifle, but a... when you're just like, I don't know where things are and I don't like it. As long as no one comes over around the corner, we're good. I don't even think I heard it. Because I, I, I have these on and these are noise cancelling and that came from the computer system itself. And I think I, we had turned the, the volume down for that so I didn't have any uh, back feed issues. Oh, you're going. You're jumping up there. Okay, man. I swear there's supposed to be one with a gun. There's a bright red flower blooming by the pond. We might cut through nil. Alright, we might be able to make this a clean getaway if there's actually not one with a gun, if he stayed inside or something. for it. No, 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 Hurry. I swear there was uh, one over here, though, at some point. But he's not there. And I feel like I'm just walking this to our death so, like, I'm missing something. Oh, yeah. You're blind. You gotta... Okay, let's go. Usually there's a, there's a rifle, there's not a rifle, but a, a pistol wielding Shibito somewhere in the general vicinity. So I'm not sure uh, where exactly he went. I mean, yay me, but... to wait till the end to explain the full story behind the game because it's kind of long and confusing and I may not be 100% correct yet because there's different stories depending no on I, I each person-ish kind of so there's like backstories to things if you're out there filming me going round and round, round, round in circles, circles I'm, gonna I'm gonna kill, kill all, all of you, you. <laughs> but uh yeah it's really long story but a big the easiest way to put it is monster from the Shouldn't past cursed village bad sacrifice here we go <laughs> I don't want to spoil the whole thing so mission two retro to Jenna could be valley after all defeating all should be no fuck you fuck you and your need to defeat everything I still feel like I can see her underwear through her pants because of how they do all the... Maybe I can. Maybe she's just wearing some really thick underwear. And she needs to be wearing thicker pants. I don't know.
<laughs> so far, what's happened is some kid came to a village, uh, as did a professor who used to live there, and his student followed him, and the main character, Kyoya, interrupted a ceremony for sacrificing the blind chick, and now they've been sucked into the underworld. And so all the villagers have become undead. As the people who are not yet undead uh, will slowly be going insane. Basically, if they... There's, like, basically almost no escape. I think only one character actually does escape. But I won't tell who. That would ruin the fun. And I'm not jumping down right now because I'm just going to hit you. And I will be upset. Visible. All right. Jump. Don't break an ankle in those heels. Goodbye. She went really smooth and I'm kind of surprised. But now this one I think has a different walking path than last time maybe? There's a lean feature here so I can actually see. gonna happen is he's gonna go there he's gonna come in he's gonna walk down he's gonna slightly come in and then he's gonna walk back out and I'm gonna book it that way I hope otherwise I'm just gonna get killed You didn't see me, you only heard me. I am safe! I am so safe. I hope I am so safe. But I may not be, I don't know where he is yet. Oh shit, he's coming. see me. I'm behind something. I'm so behind something. So well behind something you don't even know. <laughs> I am a 
master of camouflage. Look at that pole. He wouldn't know it's me. Oh, wait. Get off, get off the barrels, please. Oh my god. He usually doesn't go that far. Glad he's got bad eyesight and didn't bring his glasses today. comes back automatically. It's just kind of part of the, the thing on this one. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Don't you call at me. The fruit. Alright, this time I need this, I believe. Pick up. Key to shaft number five east. So I cannot leave this one until I get everybody down, and that can be a hit or miss, and if I don't get it, I have to redo the whole damn thing. So here we go! Hey buddy! I like your hood. Look, I don't have time for your howling. faster. I may have done this backwards and I may just fuck this up for me, but we'll find out. Yeah, I think I did this backwards. I think I was supposed to go into three first, then five, and this would take out the shooter. Well, yeah, we'll try anyway. Yep, 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 that's what happened. So when everybody's there, I'm supposed to run in there and do that. I'll try though, I can still attempt. Here you. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get it though. Yes. 